Hey guys and welcome back to my studio. So in this video I'm gonna showcase the composition, the lighting and the building process of four new miniature sets. So the concept is called the hidden oasis on Mars, which includes scenes of Mars, a Martian cave, and an abstract portal which takes you to an oasis water world. I wanted to add some sci-fi elements to the shots to tell a story that a secret civilization might be out there. I made this video together with Nanlight to showcase creative ways you, which you can use light and also showcase the importance of lights in general. Stick around to the end of this video where you will see all the miniature sets come together without the behind the scenes. Okay, so let's jump into it. To build the planet I used a 160 centimeter large yoga ball. Then I added a lot of glue, paper mache, a hobby caster and also some newspaper to get the right structure for the planet. Then I let it dry overnight and started painting with uh, acrylic colors. You can see here I mix a bit of sand within the acrylic wash to get some extra details of the planet. So when everything was done I took it to the blue screen and added a wire to let it hang in the air because I wanted a rotation movement of the planet while shooting it. The light I'm using here is the Forza 720B which I used to act as a sun, almost like a time lapse. In terms of editing, there is not really much to it. Everything you see is made in camera. So for the Martian tunnel, I started off fill the right dimensions. So just trying out to see where everything should sit before using aluminium foil, clay and also Hobbycast to build up the landform. And here you can see me building the roof of the cave. I wanted this to be a separate piece of the miniature so I could have more control in changing the environment and lighting. I used the Nanolite Pavotube 6C. So in terms of lighting I wanted to create a silhouette look but with the light reflecting a lot of detail into the sci-fi elements of the miniature. I also used a fog machine to to create depth and separation in the image. In terms of digital effects, I green screened myself walking with the hiking clothes, but I knew that it would almost look like a spacesuit when it's silhouetted. So this is the abstract portal. So I used sandpaper to get better grip for the acrylic colors. And I also mixed in sand to the acrylic colors to get even more fine details. I wanted everything to be very centered and very minimalistic. So I built this miniature around the shape of the Nanlite Pavotube 15X to act as a portal or gateway light. So this is the Oasis miniature which is totally different from the other miniatures. I used a blue color instead of orange. So I used the Nanlite app here to make a preset of the color I wanted to have to get a nice contrast from the rest of the miniatures. I wanted to have this watery reflection within the set so I used a plastic tray and filled it up with water and a small shake to get tiny waves. So yeah, I hope you learned something and uh, enjoyed the final results.